Hi, I'm Scott Mills. We all know things like Red Sky at Night, Shepherd's Delight, we've all heard them. But is that true or is it just a load of old nonsense weather folklore? Well, today I'm here at the Met Office to meet meteorologist Charlie Powell. He can tell me, surely. He does the weather. Charlie! England, it's a fairly decent hello. Oh, and, uh, oh. Nice to, I'm actually still in the oh, middle. Okay, of, cool. If you wouldn't mind probably just yeah. ducking down, that would be absolutely great. So it means, at least for most of us, we end the morning on a fairly decent dry note with some sunshine. <laughs> Two thirds of us truly believe that if cows are lying down, then it's going to rain. Charlie, is this true? Yes. Yes? No. Oh, how come? Well, there's no scientific proof to suggest that they're not just being tired, chilling out, chewing the cud. Oh, okay, just lazy cows. Mm -hmm. For instance, I asked this one to lie down just a few minutes ago, point blank refuse me. So what we're saying, true or not? Not. Okay, there's no proof. May as well check the Met Office forecast. Red sky at night, shepherd's delight. 80% of us think that's true. Charlie, is this real? I like this one, but we need two things. High pressure and a prevailing southwesterly wind. Of course. The high pressure gives us pretty settled weather, but it also traps bits of dust and dirt in the atmosphere. In the evening, the low sun filters out blue part of the spectrum, which gives us our red sky at night. Mm -hmm. And the prevailing wind then brings in that fine weather from the south and west. Okay, excellent. So that one is true. Ish. Ish. <laughs> Over half of people believe that if pine cones are opening up, it's a sign of good weather to come. Charlie? Yeah, this is a good one. When the air is dry, the scales on the pine cone, they become quite stiff and they stand out, which suggests that fine weather's on the way. But of course, when there's wetter weather on the way, the atmosphere's got more moisture, so they actually become more flexible, shrink back up, suggesting there's less climate weather on the way. <laughs> Obviously, I knew that. Is it true or not? Yeah, it's true. You know what they say, if it rains by seven, it'll be fine by 11. Charlie, what's all that about? Well, most of our weather systems are spawned in the Atlantic, and as they rattle across the UK, you give them a couple hours, it should have dried out. Okay, so true or not true? Partial truth, because if you've got light winds or a big broad band of rain, then it may end up raining all day, so it's always best to check the Met Office forecast. Two thirds of us in the UK believe it can be too cold to snow. I'm here in the operation centre at the Met Office with Charlie. What's the deal with this one? Tough cookie. Ideally, temperature needs to be around zero Celsius. The temperatures we're talking about are minus 10 or minus 20, which we don't see that often in the UK. Mm -hmm. It's also so dry, that temperature, that it's almost impossible for snow to form. So you need so many different factors to come together in the UK for it to snow or not to snow. Right, so for us in the UK, largely false. Mm -hmm. 